Alright, today I'm going to go through the steps on how to automatically back up your game save data. Having your game save data backup is great for when you're replacing your PS4 hard drive or if you're just getting a new PS4. Whatever the reason, it's just nice to have it backed up online. Oh, and you will need to have a PS membership to use the auto upload feature. So let's begin. You will need to activate your PS4 as your primary PS4 for this to work. Um, so you go to account management, or you go to settings, account management, then you go to activate as your primary PS4. Right there. Oh, and the auto upload feature only works on your primary PS4, so it won't work on another machine that's not your primary. Okay, one more thing we need to do is make sure our PS4 stays connected to internet. So we'll go to power save settings from the settings menu. And we go to that. And make sure stay connected to the internet is checked off. Alright, so now that we have that stuff out of the way, we can make sure our auto update feature is activated. So for that, we'll need to go to go back and head on up to Application Save Data Management. All right, so we'll scroll down to Auto Upload. Oh, you can also save your data on USB there if you want that option. So we'll go down to Auto Upload. Okay, so from here we can select uh, which game we want our game save data to be uploaded. So whichever game you want backed up, just make sure it's checked. And that's all you really need to do. Alright, so once it's online and you want to download it to your new system or new hard drive, what you have to do is just go up to the save data in online storage. which is up over here and we go to save data in online storage we'll select that and you have a list of uh, game saves that you have backed up online right there will give you option to download to system storage which basically uh, restores your data back onto your current PS4 you also have the option to manually upload any save game data files. So we go up to save data in system storage. We'll select that. And here we'll have the option to upload to online storage. So you can do that as well. Alright guys, so I hope this was helpful and thanks for watching the video.